Now, now we are going to see few problems on metric spaces. The very classical problem that any textbook that gives you in metric spaces is we are going to consider the set to be the set of real numbers and the metric is defined to be the absolute value of the differences between those two points okay and here easily from the definition of the absolute value what we have absolute of x minus y is always non-additive okay let me take absolute of x minus y to be 0 then this tells me that x minus y is 0 this is the only possibility if this is true then I will have x and y are same right and if x and y are same then x minus y is 0 okay if x minus y is 0 then absolute of x minus y is 0 the first condition is satisfied the second condition is absolute of x minus y is nothing but minus times of absolute of y minus x uh, absolute of minus value is same as that of absolute of that value symmetry is satisfied okay the third condition is we have let us we have this okay let us consider this and without changing the value of this thing let me add and subtract any arbitrary quantity that was taken from r okay what happens this can be considered in this form okay using the property of the absolute value it may be split in this way if this is d of x y then this is d of x z and this is d of z y okay and this proves this is a metric space with respect to this metric 